Greenland is losing a lot of ice. The ice melts away, but also moves much faster into the ocean. I'm Connie Steffen, director of Cirrus, the Cooperative Institute for Research in Among Sciences. So the last 33 years I have gone to the Arctic, and in the last 17 years I started a project on the Greenland ice sheet. And that's how I really got my students and the grad students and grad students involved in doing field research. We are losing about 200 cubic kilometers of ice. This is enough fresh water for entire Germany for one and a half years, what they use. And since we lose that big amount of ice, sea level is rising. And the big question today is how quickly is responding the ice to the warming? In Greenland itself, we have about seven meters of sea level stored, 21 feet. And we expect that within the next 50 to 100 years, a large part of the sea level rise will come from the Greenland ice sheet. Maybe one foot, maybe two feet. And that is a big difference. So we try to understand processes, put it into the models, and make it available for our policymakers and the public at large. Last year, for example, I had beside the CNN and NSNBC News and BBC film team, the policymakers came to our Greenland Ice Sheet camp, namely Nancy Pelosi and a whole staff from Congress, the Energy Committee, several people from Congress, to see firsthand what we are doing on the Greenland Ice Sheet. They wanted from us the explanation, why is it happening, what is happening, and what should we do? So we really have to look into the future in several generations from today, because we want to ensure that the Earth is sustainable as it is today for many generations to go.